Hello, I'm Hasan Raja and I'm here with some more questions. So it's a topic of pronoun. Noun. So now ready. Carpenters, dentists, swing machine, operators, needle pointers, piano players, and indeed anyone who works with their hands for long hours can get carpal tunnel syndrome. Look, the word is dear right so we should know that why dear is given no doubt to follow plural noun but if we look at it says anyone who works with their hands doesn't give correct sense right so we need plural noun so a out anyone b out workers with their hands fine but if we look at the whole sentence we will find that it is incomplete indeed worker with their hands for long, long hours can get carpal tunnel so it's incorrect why because we need workers plus verb so c out now d those for whom work is here it must be whose work rather than whom work because it doesn't give correct sense by the way whom plus subject plus verb is correct sense and we need plural noun so e also out it's mean we left with e now look at anyone any people who work with their hands for long hours can get carpal tunnel syndrome by the way as i said in general the common error that is asked in pronoun part is it family and they family let's have a look of one more question it says although napoleon armies sorry although napoleon's army entered russia with far more supplies than they had in their previous campaigns it had provisions for only 24 days now we have pronoun they so we have to justify whether they is correct or not if they is correct automatically there will be also correct so in the sentence the subject is army not napoleon remember whenever any group of words are attached with apostrophe the word comes after apostrophe becomes subject so army entered russia with far more supplies than so they is used for army it's incorrect why army is collective noun and it should always be it so a out b c and d all out why because use of their as we have used they incorrect there is also incorrect why because we don't have any plural noun to refer so in one go out e is the answer the point is they and their should be always for plural noun and after that there must be correct sense too Sometimes when we use pronoun, after looking at the reference, we have to look at correct sense or correct meaning too. So if we go ahead with the situation that we have, look, although aspirin irritates the stomach, it can be avoided. So if we look at it is here, the use is use of it is correct. Why? Because spring can be avoided but the real sense is irritation can be avoided rather than aspirin it can be avoided if aspirin table is given a coating that will not dissolve until the tablet reaches the intestine right so irritation can be avoided can be a good option so here we can eliminate a right now same time we can eliminate even d2 why because aspirin causes a stomach irritation although it can it's mean aspirin can be avoided 
Now let with B, C and E. B says the irritation of the stomach caused by aspirin can be avoided. So irritation can be avoided fine. C says the fact that aspirin causes irritation of the stomach can be avoided. So what the fact can be avoided that is incorrect sentence. Now the last one, aspirin irritates the stomach. Which can be avoided? It means stomach can be avoided. Again, it's incorrect. So we are left with choice B. This is the correct answer.